Well, a wave of anti-immigrant sentiment is being blamed for a series of drive-by shootings in central Italy. An Italian mayor says the shooting attacks on African migrants was racially motivated and may be linked to the brutal murder of an 18-year-old Italian woman. Now, the shootings happened in the same town where a Nigerian man was arrested in connection with a woman's murder. The suspect arrested over those shootings was reportedly seen making a fascist salute in front of a war memorial. Bobby Nadori joins me now live from Rome. Bobby, firstly, what can you tell us about this Italian man who was arrested over the shootings? We know that he was a member who had run for office of the Northern League, uh, which is an, an, a far-right party that has been campaigning ahead of elections here in Italy in March on an anti-immigration stance. Um, he went around with his car and his pistol and looked very specifically, according to police, for African migrants in this town, shooting them. He shot six people, five men and one woman, none of them fatally, but two of them quite seriously. And the people of the town uh, including the mayor, as you mentioned, are, are saying this is really connected to the discovery of a woman's body that had been dismembered and left in suitcases last week and the rest of a Nigerian migrant um, in that particular murder. Um, the uncle of the victim, of the woman who had been killed, uh, said that while we want, all we want is justice, we cannot fight barbarism with more barbarism. Such act actions are not justifiable. Um, but we've heard several comments by a, a number of the far-right parties here in Italy that have offered to pay his legal fees, that have been supporting him, and then several of the more moderate ones, including the Northern League, saying that this was a fascist act that does not reflect the party. So there are lots of things being sorted out about just who, what his motivation was, and what, uh, whether this was revenge killing, or whether this was just an action uh, of, of, of someone who had, uh, you know, committed this horrific act, Linda. And of course, Barbie, uh, the elections in Italy happen next month. How big an issue is immigration right now? Immigration is the number one issue in the elections next month. You know, there were 180,000 migrants that came to Italy in 2016, 119,000 that came across the sea last year. It is the number one issue here, with all of the parties essentially leading their campaigning with a way to resolve the issue, whether that means stopping the migrants, whether that means leaving, uh, investing more in Libya to try to keep the migrants from crossing. It, it is the number one issue here. And the Northern League, uh, together with other of the centers, to right parties are polling ahead of, of the parties that have more lenient stance towards migration and integration. Um, so it's, it's a huge issue here and there's a lot of racial tension surrounding that, Linda.